bubble cap tray was the most used device through the 1940s and early 1950s. An amazing number of them are still in service. The tray consists of a riser with a cap on the top. The vapor flows through the riser and around the cap and contacts the liquid as it flows across the tray. The one unique advantage of the bubble cap is that it provides positive assurance that there will be total vapor liquid contacting without bypassing of the vapor. Their main drawbacks are due to the complex cap design. The caps present an obstruction to liquid flow, particularly in high liquid loaded towers. Also, a large fraction of the vapor phase pressure drop is wasted as it occurs in the reversal area between the riser and the cap where it does not enhance the mass transfer. The labor cost of assembling the riser cap units makes these trays more expensive. The weight of these units also leads to support problems on large towers. Consequently, most new applications today are in services where a large amount of vapor must contact a relatively small amount of liquid.